Hi guys and welcome back to the Canadian Glam Bam channel. Glam Bam here and today's video as you can see is going to be the what's in my Ipsy bag video. Um, before I jump right into that portion of the video I am going to quickly discuss one product. Um, it's a product that I picked up recently that I've been loving so far um, and it is the Hard Candy Velvet Mousse Matte Lip Color and this lip color is it says new look um, so I believe it's new packaging, ever packaging, and probably the same formula, but I'm not quite sure. <clears throat> but when you open it up, there's this really pretty mirror, and then you pull out the package. So for me, it's kind of overdone with the packaging, and the packaging itself is a little bit deceiving, because when you pick up the packaging, if you've never purchased it before, you think by the size of it that it's going to be this huge lip product inside and while it's very wide, it is very sleek and thin. So it's kind of deceiving in the sense that you think you're going to get a lot of product and really it doesn't look like there's quite a lot in there. It's a lot for me because I won't go through this very quickly. I do tend to switch products up and I'm constantly trying new products and buying new products. So for me this would last quite a while, but for somebody that's more on the wear the same kind of makeup every single day would go through something like this awfully quick. So I'll just do a quick swatch for you. Um, this is the color Cherry Blossom. Now they do have a very, um, in my opinion, quite the range of colors. I will be picking some more up so I can do um, a review video and swatch video if you'd, if you'd like to see something like that let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, just uh, wanted to give a quick review on that and tell you what I think because I've noticed quite a few of the other YouTubers that I watch that I subscribe to their channels did um, tutorial this on their drugstore makeup haul so I was kind of it piqued my interest a little bit and I thought I'd pick it up and I was actually quite impressed with it so if that's something you're looking for like a liquid lip something that's matte but on a lower end scale that's not going to break the bank um, this is definitely something to pick up. I think it was like maybe five, six dollars. But now on to the portion of the what's in my Ipsy bag. So this month's bag looks like this. They definitely designed it so it was spring in mind for this month. So it's really cute. Um, the first thing when I opened the packaging that it came in the mail, um, there was actually the brush inside because obviously it didn't fit in the bag. So this month's brush is the Luxie 522 Tapered Highlighter Brush. It's actually the brush that I used to do my highlight today. And for all the reviews and raving that I've heard about this brush, um, I'm actually quite impressed with it. And it would definitely, I would definitely look into buying some more Luxie brushes. The brushes are really, really fluffy and they're really soft. So I was kind of impressed with this. It's definitely going to be my new highlighter brush for sure. Um, opening the bag, the first thing that's in it is the Skin Dimitri James Bright Eyes Eye Enhancing Eyeliner. Now I have tried this. It's what I'm using on my waterline today. Um, and by the way, if you'd like something, a, a tutorial on a look, um, on this look right here, make sure that you comment in the section below so that I know it is something that you're going to see. This look was created using the BH Galaxy palette. So um, I said that I would do a video, but I thought I'd give you a kind of preview to the kind of video that I would do, or a kind of spring look that I would try. So this is one of the looks that I've created using that palette. So if that is something you want to see, make sure that you leave a comment so that I know it is. So going back to this eyeliner, this eyeliner is a very nude color. Um, so it's not your typical uh, NYX white eyeliner pencil or anything that you would see for brightening up, but this is going to work great on any skin tone. So I thought that was a good idea that they put in. And it's a full size, so I was happy to see that too. The next thing is Moroccan oil treatment for all hair types. Um, I've never used this product before, so I'm kind of curious to see, and especially since I've kind of recently been into trying to get some more hair treatments to fix the damage that was done to my hair. Um, 
I am interested to try this and I will do a updated review on these products when I speak through them about my next videos or so but it's something interesting to try uh, next one is the Tarte Lip Surgeons Lip Cream and this is in the shade Wonder so I was really excited about this um, because I was going to purchase some Tarte lip products anyways so um, before I got to spend my money on it I was actually able to get a trial size which is really nice and this color is almost like a raspberry color similar to the cherry blossom that's on my lips from Hard Candy and from what I can tell I've worn this once the other day and took a picture of it when I showed what's in my Ipsy bag video um, the pre-hand pictures that I took and it lasted quite a while before I had to reapply and I did drink tea and eat lunch with it on and I didn't have to reapply immediately after it was probably I want to say about two hours after I ate so I wore it for about six hours before having to reapply so for me that's actually really good uh, the last thing in my Ipsy bag is the Star Lux Cream Eyeshadow, and this is the shade Rose Gold. I have not tried this yet, um, so I'm just going to do a swatch of it. It's very liquidy compared to some of the other cream eyeshadows that I have, and I'm not typically a fan of cream eyeshadows because for some reason my eyes don't take to cream eyeshadows very well, but this seems to be a really pretty color. And it seems very light and it dries pretty quickly so I'm, I'll am i give it a try and maybe use it in one of my upcoming videos so that I can show you guys how I use it and um, kind of do a quick review on it at the same time. <clears throat> so that was everything in my Ipsy bag this month. If the Ipsy bag videos are something that you want to continue to see, please leave a comment below but if it's not something you guys are really going to be interested in. I'm not going to film them because, I mean, I could just fill that extra video a week or a month with something else that you guys would rather see. Um, again, if you'd like a tutorial on the look that I'm wearing or simpler, something similar using that Galaxy palette, please make sure to comment below. Uh, make sure you like, thumbs up, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, thanks, and remember to inspire and be inspired. Bye.